The first Yoga Journal conference that I taught in was actually here in New York City. Yoga Journal has changed my life, helping me connect to a larger yoga community. The YJ bubble is a very special place, but what makes it so special for me are the students, and it's so inspiring for me, and so I bring back this huge dose of inspiration to my personal practice. Sometimes this conference, it's like going to a buffet. You need to try everything, and then you're a little bit like, whoa, what just happened? <laughs> my loyalty to Yoga Journal is, uh, is sincere because it's been a, um, a very loving, a very trusting relationship. Yoga Journal has been a lovely impact on my life. John Abbott, the last owner, had me doing the keynote addresses for the major conferences before, and the word has spread that yoga is more than just exercise. I've been going to the Yoga Journal live events since I was in my 20s. I've met so many people that lifelong friendships have been made. I think the best thing we can take away when we leave this event is a fresh look at the practice. Look at it a little differently. Come from a different vantage point now.